Hi everyone, it's Team AJ. Hope you guys are all doing well. We are bringing you along for the third annual Crew of Krampus Snowball Fight. Yes, we are here at the amazing Madame Vix. We also have Skins and Bones performing in the background. We are all going to be judging the six crews that made their own snowball flavors. We're gonna be judging them and there's gonna be a winner. So we are excited. We love the crew of Krampus. They are amazing people because they're all about making parades accessible. So many friends and family, people that we know have accessibility issues and the crew of Krampus makes this possible to set up separate places on the streets so everyone can enjoy the parades in our city all year round. So let me tell you what the snowball fight actually is. Mm -hmm. It's a fight between different flavors of New Orleans style snowballs. It's a cone inside a cup that is made out of soft ice, soft shaped ice with syrup poured on top of it. Flavored syrup that is. In this case, these crews that my wife mentioned are making their own snowball flavors and putting it on top of this shaved ice and they're fighting it out to see which one is the best. So come along with us as we show you, show you what a New Orleans snowball really is and why we enjoy this event so darn much. And why the New Orleans snowballs are the best. Yes, they are. Yep, for sure. Krampus is coming. Krampus is coming. Krampus is coming. We're here at the 2024 Krampus Snowball Fight. I just want to talk about why we're doing this, and that is to make accessibility happen on every parade route. And they were the first ones that had an accessibility road that covers all needs, everything from people in wheelchairs to and people who have issues with different sounds, noises, and so forth. They have a whole quiet zone for the Krampus Parade. So shout out to them and shout out to the cause, and that's what this is all about. Donating money to be able to provide more safe, zones, more quiet zones, more accessibility zones for the Mardi Gras parades and other parades in this city. We're here with Skins and Bones and we're about to try that hot chocolate, hot chocolate. This is marinated in chocolate liqueur or this is regular? Ooh, you got chocolate too? Ooh. It's hot chocolate. Alright, I'm going to do one of each. I'm going to spice it up a little bit. Alright, okay. Spice it up. That looks delicious. A cherry for my beautiful cherry. My turn to try the snowball though. Ooh. It's like a chocolate covered cherry. That's so good. My turn to try the skins and bones special. The hot chocolate. It's hot, it's spicy. My wife says it tastes great, so let's do this. That's a very that's a very thick chocolate. There is a kick to it. There is some cayenne pepper for sure. Mm -hmm. It's very kicky, but this is actually good. We're here with the muffaladas now. Look at all Hello. the beautiful muffins here. Yes, yes. Parades are coming soon. Yeah. Yes, they bring it on. The, they bring their A game always. But right now, we got the itsy bitsy teeny weeny yellow polka dot bellini snowball here. So 
sounds like it's gonna be fun. Yep, very tropical peach mango lemonade flavor. Ooh. We got our bikinis and our little inner tubes. Would you like to give it a shot? Let's give it a go. So I have one question for you. How do you come up with these flavors? Because you guys are all so creative. We do some brainstorming. We have a great group of ladies. We obviously try to draw from our diner waitress era. And we love dancing to the oldies. So when we are listening to our playlist, we come up with a little bit of a fun twist on some of the songs that we know and love. Do you say fun twist? So you want to be in your polka dot bikini yeah. and drink so us, drinking on a polka dot bellini. Okay, so this is very sweet. The other one, if you love chocolate, you are going to love the other one. If you love something more sweet and fruity, you'll love this. Oh, why are you guys making it so tough? So we are here with our friends, the streetcar strutters. Look at how beautiful they look. All the girls and the crews always look so beautiful and handsome. We love you guys. But today, they have a special concoction that we're trying. So what are we trying today, girls? Butterbeer! Oh. Wow! Well, butter beer. Wow, I feel like we're back in Universal today! So have you seen that wizard? I'm getting my ticket. Gotta give me a ticket so they get a punch. And what's really cool is, she watches us. Harry Potter line impressions. Oh, there's a lot of lines. That's going to be hard because everything about Harry Potter is awesome. I don't know. What's your favorite Harry Potter line? It's Lemmy uh, uh, That was good. My voice is still shot, but I got to do it too. Master Game Dobby Socks? <laughs> what you think, baby, about the butter beer? The shredder butter. Wow. I'm going to be honest, the Butterbeer at Universal is really good, really sweet. You brought it down a notch. Yes. So it's not too sweet. Yes. I love this. Because even like when we're at Universal, as much as I love the Butterbeer, but after a little bit, you're like, all right, it's really, really sweet, but it's so good. I like what you did with this and brought it down here. Really good and not super sweet. What about the stuff? Food the looking glass. Because we're here with the Crescent City Fed and they're pre presenting their drink through the looking glass. And it's got strawberries, basil, pear cane sugar, black tea, lemon juice, and zest, lime zest, ginger juice, cinnamon clove, allspice, and a little citric acid for flavor. Let's rock and roll, baby. Yes, look at how cute you girls look. look they're all representing characters from Alice in Wonderland. I'm telling you, oh, yeah, yeah, sure. they're the stars, not they're the stars. Yeah, we'll see them in Alice. They're all mad here. <laughs> all right, so let's try it. We gotta get out of the way. Especially this one. That one's crazy. For sure. Let me try it again because I get out of the camera. Mm. Like a nice fall dry. 
break. Yeah. yeah I mean, it, it's really, really unique. It is another unique snowball. So the ice can pull you off and, and make you wish it was fall. Mm. So, Jen, are you enjoying your trip to the looking glass? Mm. We love Alice in Wonderland. You guys, you girls look amazing. Thank you. Oh my God, This is very fall. I got a, I got a feeling between them and another crew, we're gonna be competing for who's the most fall today. This is good though. I'm digging this, and the flavor kind of sneaks up on you. It does, but it's refreshing. Oh yeah, no doubt. It starts off slow, then bam, right in the face. So we are with our friends, the crew of the Rolling Alibi, and of course we have the beautiful Priscilla. Yeah, sisters of 
We're gonna do it too. <laughs> so yeah, come out and see us in December yeah. for the Korean Krampus. I know y'all will be there because yeah. we see everybody. We don't have video, of course, yes. Kate. Um, but yes, check them out. Yes. Join. And Krampus is coming. Krampus is coming. I try. One. some red beans coming. We wouldn't be having to do all this fun without some red beans. It ain't even Monday, but you still gotta get them in. I got my red beans, time to go for it. This is good. This is good. This, I'm, I'm trying them for the first time right now. This is good. I enjoy the red beans. By the way, that's the man who put all this together, so shout out to him. Shout out to Mr. Mike. But these red beans are where it's at. So we are here with our friend Tuesday from the Mata Mata. Hi, y'all. I'm off duty tonight. So I'm just coming out to support my mommy sisters. Go team mommies. Yes. Are you having a great time? I am. I am. We are too. This is hard, the competition. I know. There's so many great, off, like, so many great snowballs. Like, I got this Jonah Hart right. snowball now. That's fantastic.